what drives me absolutely insane is people that never use their gas pedal. They just let this some bitch idle everywhere it goes. Speed limit through here is 40, and this guy's doing 30. What are you slowing down for? They're just f squirrels. Well, howdy. Let's go ahead and back on out of the O'Reilly's. We have been blessed with such a beautiful day. It is not raining, thank you, Lord. It has just been a torrential downpour for the last week and a half, and I'm finally able to get something done. Finally able to do some recording. And I mean, with it, everything being on lockdown and, and being in quarantine, yeah, that hasn't helped either. So I've just been anxiously chomping at the bit to get something done. What are all you non-essentials doing out here? There's nothing to do. Go home. You know what? Screw it. I'm going this way. But yes, just to start this video off, the uh, excursion video, the pros and cons of owning an excursion, has hit over 1,500 views. It's gotten 44 likes. Uh, quite a few people have commented. It got couple of subscribers picked up from that one and I thank you guys so much like it's it's gotten me in a mood to just keep going and keep doing what it is that we do and uh, it's fantastic but yeah like I said today we're gonna replace the wheel bearings on the Ranger how I'm gonna make that entertaining I have the slightest idea Jacob's gonna be coming over helping us out with that so we'll see you back at the house Uh, you know, you'd think I would spend more time organizing my toolbox considering all of the uh, quarantine regulations and all that and everything and blah, 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 but, uh, you know, shit happens. You're looking for that curvy thingy, aren't you? Yeah. That's a good question. <laughs> Whatever it is, we may have yeah. a call. I'm trying to fix this. You pose a really good point. What, about the organization thing? Yeah, where the fuck is my crime bar? No, this is seriously starting to annoy me. Where'd it go? Found it. Ah, see? I know I this tool is better than he does. I did put it away. I just didn't put it away. It's loud. It's not as loud as an air gun. Yippee. I'm telling you, dude, we need camera angles. We do. So where's your GoPro? At home. Right? Oh, Jesus. I will do my best to refrain from showing my ass crack. You already did once. Damn it. <laughs> That's crazy. That's loose. 15, 20. Oh, dang it. I was wrong. <laughs> I thought it was a 12. You see, the good thing about my toolbox being somewhat organized is I still kind of know where everything's at. Organized in your mind because no one else is. I will admit the top drawer doesn't make any sense. And everything on top of the toolbox doesn't make any sense. But everything else, brilliant. I'm sick of this thing vibrating me to death. I'm gonna laugh when it still vibrates. It probably will. <laughs> but uh, shut up, Jake. This is supposed to fix it. Cool. But like, I'm, I'm really not wanting the channel to be like a tutorial kind of channel. I just want to. I hate tutorials. I just, I just want to fuck around, right? Yeah. Be funny. I guarantee somebody's gonna watch this video and go, please bust some knuckles. Please bust some knuckles. Well, you can bust knuckles on brakes. Yeah. You can bust knuckles just about anything. I can bust knuckles taking wheels off, right? I can bust knuckles taking a dog. Hurry up and delete the crap off your phone before my battery dies so we don't lose any. I'm working on it. Gotta take a lot of pictures of car. Go faster. You're obsessed. Oh, I can give a neat little pro tip right now. We're not a tutorial channel. I know, but check this out. This is awesome. I'm gonna get this wheel bearing seal out of here without using any tools. Let me pull the disc off and show that that little seal right there. I'm gonna pull that off without using any freaking tools. You'll take note, okay? I've taken out the, the outer bearing and the, and the plate here, okay? And I put the nut back on. So all I'm gonna do is set this down, grab this. Ta-da. Pulled the seal. <laughs> the new GI Pulled the seal and the bearing. 
no problems. Now, I've had that backfire on me. <laughs> I've had that really backfire on me. Oh man, this thing is shot. Gloves. Yeah. I want this nasty crap all over my fingers. There's only one large. <laughs> I ran out, okay? How do you have one left? Okay, you know what? When we're done here, we'll go to Harbor Freight. You're just gonna go ahead and wing it? Wait. Oh, you're gonna wait. What are you looking for? A quarter inch. Quarter inch what? Ratchet. Why do you need a quarter inch ratchet? To loosen it. Use a, UTI come over here and grab what I got. UTI tells us not to use electric tools. Look, there's a 13 millimeter wrench. That should be more than enough to get that freaking thing off. I'm not very strong. That's your problem, not mine. <laughs> Better start eating your Wheaties. I haven't done brakes in a minute. Don't tell me that. You telling me that doesn't exactly boost a lot of confidence. Like you had any to begin with? Uh, I had some. Oh, oh, I'm flattered that you had some. Um, is that breaker bar for the bracket? Yes. Oh. Oh, gosh. oh, do you need me to kick it over to you? Yeah, that'd be handy. There you Thank go. You. God, you're so needy. <laughs> this is a lot easier when it's on a lift and I'm not on my knees. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't completely accommodate all your needs. Are you really sorry though? Not really. Where is my drawer of Jeremy's? My drawer of oh, Jeremy's. I can't it. I gotta redo it. There you the go. homage. Had to, take a, had to take a break. I'm at. Normally I don't reuse cotter pins, but since this is my truck, fuck it. If I die, I die. <laughs> I mean. I saw an old VW today. I have a little it's a no seatbelt to be got like real men. It's like, it's a VW, it's an old VW. How fast are you going to where you're gonna die? Not very. Because you're driving off a cliff. Just to make note, this is not an educational channel. We're just bored out of our skulls because of this damn pandemic. Rabbit. Damn pandemic. Damn pandemic. I gotta say, and if this doesn't fix my shaking problem at 65 to 70 mile an hour, the only thing I can think of is to start replacing suspension components, and I don't want to do that until I buy the lowering kit. UTI way is you don't just throw parts out of vehicles. You know what? F UTI. <laughs> but if there's anything I've learned from working at a Ford dealership, that's most technicians throw parts at it until it's fixed anyway. Okay, let's take all of these over to the other side. Who sings that? Adele. Leave it to her, please. He said, let there be light. Take that off, do your fancy trick. Backyard redneck ingenuity right here. Ta-da! Wait, so Wonder. if it's that easy to do that, then why doesn't it fall off on the highway? Because this is holding all of that together. And that doesn't go this way when it's going down the highway. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> if it does, you're having a bad day. <laughs> Excuse me while I uh, get my bearings here. Laugh <laughs> 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 uh, track, laugh track. Ha, 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 ha. Yeah, I got a fancy pool over there to do this in a matter of seconds, but uh, it doesn't have any grease in it. <laughs> I don't have a grease gun to fill it back up. Why would you even say that? Because like, I really you trying to remind to myself that like, hey, dumbass, you need to do this. You want to flex that you have fancy tools? I like my fancy tools, okay? I you spent bought, a lot of freaking money on them. How many tools in this in these boxes have you used once? No, see, my thing was, I wouldn't buy a tool until I knew I was gonna use it on a regular basis. I, I got to the point where it's like, okay, if I'm gonna use this more than once, then I'm gonna buy it. <clears throat> I just got a text. But this, this GoPro camera is well, not bad. The audio on the GoPro is not bad. Kombucha Wonder Drink would like to put a small sticker on your vehicle for advert and pay you $500 weekly. Ooh. Ooh! Is that how that works? That's 26k a year. 26k a year just to drive your fucking car around? But like, like if like K and N came out to us and was like, hey. Ooh, we've made it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if we're sponsored by K and N, I think we're doing all right. I think we might be doing okay. K and N, you listening? I would love to put an intake on this truck, even though it's not going to help it any damn bit because it's only a four cylinder. I think the only corporate sponsorship I would probably bow down to right now is Rockstar. Or Monster, because we drink a lot of energy drinks. You know, just product placement have a rock star sitting right here. <laughs> Dad, what if you got sponsored by Ford? If I got sponsored by Ford, I think I'd piss myself. Go full ro roadkill sponsored by Dodge. I know. It's not that far. They got I a know. Hellcat Challenger. They just gave him one. Here you go. 
<laughs> but yeah, but you also got to realize that Fry Burger and Finnegan are very, they are very well known. They were very well known yeah. in the automotive industry before Roadkill. Fry Burger is just a walking encyclopedia when it comes to 60s and 70s cars and some 80s that the man's knowledge is just insane. It's like, how does he remember other things? Like Why you could like you could throw them off so easily though. It's like just walk up to him. Hey, Freiburger. Yeah. <laughs> what day do we celebrate our independence? Uh, I can tell you that in 1976 we celebrated our 200th anniversary of independence from Britain and in 1976 Dodge changed the Valiant to the He's mainly a Dodge guy too. Oh yeah, he he loves Mopar. And I can't knock him for that. Hey. Hey. I'm kind of bummed out that my wheel balancing theory never came true. Yeah. Because I would have felt like a motherfucking badass if I had discovered that and you were like, ah, oh, shit. Where am I at? Well, it's a good thing you have two kids already because. Now that's going to pack a punch. That's not going to just. Okay, for one, check if you're loosening or tightening. How does he do that, Jake? Buffy, loosey, ready, tighty. There you go. Go on the cross pattern. That one, that one, that one, that one. I mean, once you get to about that no. one. That's confusing. No. A cross pattern. That one, then that one, then that one, then that one, then that one. Yeah, that's what I meant. You what? went, you went that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Yeah, I know, I fucked up on one. Derp. Go for it, grab it, pull it out. Pull it out of it. That one wasn't so tight enough. A lot of my friends that are gonna watch this video go, oh, can we be fixing his Ford again? <laughs> <laughs> There's a place for everything, and everything needs to be in its place. Well, it doesn't look like it. I, yeah. I, I was gonna okay, say. Okay, y'all want me to stand here for an hour while I go through all of this I mean, and redo everything? You, you think can... they wanna see that? Well, no, yeah, so I'll, I'll shut it off. You can do it. I'll go hang out in the house for a minute. And you can have fun playing with your tools. No, 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 no. The only tools I've named are my hammers. Jeremy's. Jeremy's. They're all Jeremy. They're all Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy spoke me. Who sings that? Pearl Jam. I'll leave it for that. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm gonna sing it anyway. I'm glad you said that because I didn't know. This. I think it was Pearl Jam. <laughs> Watch me be wrong. Everybody be like, Ah, there we go. R E M. You know, you guys are useless at recording stuff. I got my I'm, back turned to that camera this whole time while we're all just screwing around, not doing I'm anything. I'm the talent. I'm not the cameraman. Ryan? We <laughs> <laughs> need like... We need like six GoPros. Well, when you move to Oklahoma, we need to set up the garage to where it's <coughs> set up to where we can flip a switch and it's record. Go. Well, if our lovely viewers and subscribers would like to like share our stuff and make us a little bit more popular maybe we can make that happen because as of right now what i'm broke <laughs> and if you think for one second you're driving this truck out of this garage you got another thing coming kid what i love is that it's like kind of a get out of jail free card being an essential worker kind of because like someone asks you are you out I'm an essential worker I mean, right now, if somebody stops us, why are you out? Uh, we're, a, we're both essential workers. Which reminds me. Oh. You have a mask? No. <laughs> oh! You don't touch your face. I just, I just want baseball feedback. <laughs> we just want baseball. We want sports. Yeah. Something competitive to watch. Yeah, four cylinders of fury. Let's go. It pops off. Bink. Uh, I am not a happy camper. I will say it feels slightly better. Slightly. I might do shocks next. Do you think that's just a pigment of your imagination wanting to make yourself feel better about spending money on parts? A, a, you didn't need. a pigment or a fig? Figment. Figment. You did say pigment. I did it? say pigment. It's a color of my imagination. <laughs> Yeah, it could be the placebo effect of like, yeah, I did something. I'm hoping it feels better, but it, I could be wrong. 259, or I know you hate Arco, but... Take your time and your silverado to go into Jack in the Box. 
going to jack off? Jack in the box. So he's jacking off in a box. <laughs> it's my dick in a box. <laughs> my mom bought her car there. Yeah, but she bought a used car, not a new car. Yeah, but and she you... bought, technically she bought it at Walmart. That's true. That is true. My mom bought her Cadillac at Walmart. If that isn't the most white trash sounding. <laughs> To explain that, that particular dealership was holding an event in the parking lot at Walmart, trying to trying to push their used cars. She went on down to Walmart and bought herself a dang old Cadillac. The like truck is now making a noise it's never made before. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Sounds like suspension bushing. Well, crap. You made it worse. I did. <laughs> Shift heads. Quality work. content. Well, the wheels haven't fallen off yet, so. Damn it. Don't look at me. My car is perfect in every way. Oh, <laughs> right. Why are our Fords constantly broken? Is that broken, though? When you say that, like, is, my car's not broken. It still works. Yeah. It just, it makes weird noises. I don't Just think like this broken. one makes weird noises. Yeah. Especially a new one that developed tonight. Some people think broken is the volume doesn't go as loud as I want it to. To me, broken is I cannot physically and legally drive this car to work. I can't I can't make this thing move under its own power. Yeah. I would say tonight was mission not accomplished. Failed. Mission no failed. Mission failed. Don't sugarcoat it. It was, it was spectacularly. It was money well wasted. <laughs> need to get that lowering kit and replace all the suspension. I just need to make I'm just going to I'm just going to jam that parts cannon full of parts. Aim it right to the front of this truck and light that fuse, man. All you need is money. All anyone needs is money. We don't have money. Please make us famous. <laughs> not with I this need money. Not with this video. Well, then what shall we do? All of our ideas cost money. All of our ideas cost money.